hey y'all welcome to my channel in today's video i'm going to review a new makeup i've checked it's not on the website it's not on google it's not on tiktok it's not on anything but i got it from influencer and this is the anastasia beverly hills beauty bomb and i got it in shade 13. let's get to the video this is a bomb now okay that is what it looks like okay i'm gonna go ahead and use my bioactive serum my repairing plumping moisturizer so I can like try to hold it because I don't have primer child I do not have primer so it is what it is it has a little twist thing to it as well so now I'm gonna pop it off so ah, look at that. I'm gonna bring y'all closer and we're gonna see y'all ready Yeah, I don't like I put anything on, but it definitely has a lot of pink in this. This is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Beauty Bomb Serum Boosted Skin Tint. It's a tinted solid serum that blends skincare and makeup with eight potent ingredients for a radiant, smooth complexion. Its silky texture ensures seamless application for a healthy, naturally even and glowy finish. Okay, so here how it's looking like so far before I even blend it. Like it is melting into my skin and it looks like it matches from afar. Like on camera, it looks like it matches. But on, but in real life, like it looks okay. I will say that. But child, I like the fact that I really didn't need to put a whole lot in. Like, look mm. oh my goodness look at that oh my goodness like my skin looks like skin look at my neck let's see if i i can add a little bit more and see if that will cover up a little bit right here around the mouth i am liking this this far Oh my goodness. Wow. Okay. Anastasia, y'all on to something. And I'm just going to lightly tap it this time. Oh my goodness. Because I have really bad hyperpigmentation on this side. Okay. And the fact that it's covering it up for it to be a serum foundation. Because serum foundations really don't cover like that. It, it gives more of like a tinted foundation, you know? Hence, um, beauty bomb, you know? This looks so freaking good. Like, amazing. It just looked like I'm wearing my skin, but I just have like more of a radiance. And I'm glad I got number 13 because everything is oxidizing like into my skin. Mind you, I don't have any um, concealer or any of that. And look how it's acting around my neck, my jawline. So now I'm going to show y'all before and then I'm going to go to the next step and see how this is going to react with other products, okay? Because I'm not going to put on a whole lot of products, but we're going to see. So here's before. Hey y'all, so for future references, I gave this a 9.5 out of 10 because it doesn't work well with powder, okay? If you want that dewy, natural look or that radiant look, then use it. It works well with concealer, but only use like a dot, like a dot here, here, here on your T-zone, okay? Don't go anymore because the concealer is very dominant when it comes to this um balm, which is really a tinted balm. It's very dominant when it comes to that. So use as a little concealer as you possibly can. But as far as powder, it does not work great with powder. Okay, I repeat, it does not work great with powder. If you wanna go ahead and use this tinted balm, I suggest you just go ahead and just dab it with the sponge to try to give you more of a matte look. Like you'll still have coverage. It'll still look nice. It'll still look radiant and more natural, but it won't be as radiant and dewy you know like you'll still get it but it won't be as powerful you know what i'm saying so that's my alternative 
to using um, a setting powder. Like that's your best bet. But if you just want like a natural summer glow or whatever that has some coverage to it, because this is a sheer to medium coverage, I would suggest you just use that and try that method. Leave the powders alone, okay? Blush, make sure it's a dewy blush. No powders, okay? Just use dewy products, okay? Just do that. Because child, everything went right until I started adding powder. <sighs> But anyway, back to the video. Okay, so here's the makeup look. I wanted something simple to the point, not overdone because again, I just wanted to do a review on this. I really like it, 9.5 out of 10, like I said, child. I thank y'all so much for watching this video and supporting. I wish I could link this product down, but it's not on the internet yet. It's just not on the internet. So anyway, and so y'all see me in my next video and you will, you will. Bye. Fuck you,